On our sale in late January, on the 27th, we are fortunate to have two masterpieces by Artemisia Gentileschi. She was probably, arguably, the most important 17th century woman artist, um, certainly one of the most important women artists of all time, and she really took art to a new level for a woman. She grew up in Orazio Gentileschi's house, and Orazio himself was an amazing artist who was inspired by Caravaggio. This picture, which I'm standing in front of now, by Artemisia, was painted in Naples around 1638, and the painting was documented early on as by Artemisia. She created the composition, and she painted all the figures, and then Viviano Codazzi did the architecture, and Nico Spadaro did the landscape. This picture by Artemisia shows the subject of Susanna and the Elders, which is a subject that would have appeal to Artemisia because it shows a very strong woman making a stand for her own rights. This beautiful young woman is taking a bath and these two older men who are kind of elders of the community are spying on her and she takes a stand against them and she's basically saying please leave me alone I'm going to report this which is something that Artemisia was very interested in and often painted in terms of the subject matter she tended to choose. She often painted Judith with the head of Holofernes, another strong woman in Judith who's standing up for her people. Artemisia was quite well known for her portraits and was quite good at them, as you can see in this unbelievably beautiful portrait that we're selling. This painting by Artemisia Gentileschi is a tour de force of portraiture of the early 17th century because she did this work in 1620 and it is not only a study of the woman most important is the incredible drapery that you see the woman wears with gold paint and silver paint and it's just a tour de force of clothing and you can see how much of the painting is about that clothing one thing to note about this painting is Artemisia painted in the finial on the top of the chair a reflection of the sitter herself. And so you can see her sort of from the side or a little bit from the back. And it's just remarkable how she took the time to think through that and make that detail come to life. She's also wearing beautiful jewelry, a lovely necklace, gorgeous earrings, and a ring. And the artist has placed her in a chair comfortably, and she also has flowers in her hair to decorate her even more. But really what this is about, most of all, is a portrait of her in this remarkable dress. One thing about Artemisia is that she painted herself very often, not only as self-portraiture, but in the guise of figures of history. So sometimes you'll see a painting of a historical or mythological figure and you'll realize it has her face. But in this case, she was known for portraiture and she was commissioned to do it. And there are other great portraits by her. And so this is not a one-off. This is something that she did and she was great at it. And you can see that in looking at this picture.
Botticelli's Christ as the Man of Sorrows is a very confrontational picture. What you see is the image of Christ staring at you with an expression in which sorrow seems to be mingled with a sense of anger at the suffering and the pain that he has had to endure on his way to crucifixion. He wears a crown of thorns that is as thick as a fat snake. His head is surrounded by these extraordinary balletic figures of angels who simultaneously carry the instruments of his torture and lament his pain. As you look into his eyes, you have the feeling that he is Christ suffering, but he's also Christ as God, who will one day stand in judgment over you. It's a painting that doesn't really ask you to admire it. It's a painting that asks you to look at it and possibly even to kneel down and pray for the state of your own soul. Botticelli was one of the leading painters of the Florentine Renaissance, and he's probably most famous for painting the birth of Venus alongside the Primavera. But in his later life, Botticelli turned away completely from that kind of erotic, secular work, and artists like Botticelli were even encouraged by Savonarola to burn their secular works, to purge themselves, to purify themselves, to focus on Christ and concentrate on the one thing that can save them, which is their Christian faith. It's suggestive and interesting that full frontal images of the face of Christ are not that common in the whole history of art. But at this moment in history, 1500, full of its apocalyptic fears and fervors, you do get this image and it recurs. Leonardo's Salvatore Mundi. Another image that I put into the same category is Dürer's self-portrait of 1500, in which Dürer shows himself as Christ. It harks back to earlier forms of Christian art, which were seen by Botticelli as purer and more noble than the art of his own day. And I think that Christ as the Man of Sorrows demonstrates that. The most compelling thing about the picture is its utter single-mindedness. There are no distractions, there are no flourishes, there's nothing that's extraneous. It is a picture which you're meant not simply to look at and then move away from. It's a picture that you're meant to spend perhaps several hours on end with, reading your Bible, looking at the painting, praying, meditating, contemplating. It puts you face to face with the idea of Jesus Christ and there's no avoiding the fact that that is what it does. It's uncompromising and I think that's its power. And once you've seen it, you can't forget it. You've been visited.
Hello everyone, my name is Christopher Apostle. I'm the director of the Old Master Paintings Department here at Sotheby's New York. Today, my colleagues and I will be taking you to see some of the great highlights we have coming up in our Master's Week sale here in New York at the end of January. From an Egyptian antiquity more than 4,000 years old to a great masterpiece by Botticelli, drawing, sculpture, paintings, all will be on view in our New York galleries at the end of the month. So why don't you join us and let's have a look. Today, I'd like to start by talking about three masterpieces of the Italian Renaissance. Secular and religious alike, each one exemplifies the artist and the culture of its milieu. I want to start in this case by a wonderful rediscovery by Antonio Allegri, better known to us today as Correggio, after his hometown. This picture is beautifully rendered on wooden panel. It depicts a reclining figure of the Mary Magdalene reading a book in a landscape. The image itself derives from a cult image of the Magdalene from a shrine in the south of France. Emblematic of Correggio's style is the beautiful sensuous depiction of the Magdalene, the wonderful attention to detail of the greenery in the foreground, the soft and almost smoky lighting. It's an example of his work at its best and something I'm very proud to present to you today. Let me take you now to see another great masterpiece by a very famous artist, Giovanni Bellini. Bellini is, without a doubt, the father of Venetian painting. He was the teacher of Titian, he was the teacher of Giorgione, the teacher of Sebastiano del Piombo. And I don't think it's an overstatement to say that before Giovanni Bellini and after Giovanni Bellini, Venetian painting was an entirely different thing. This, in fact, is an early work by the artist, dating to about 1460. It's the moment he becomes an independent master. But you already see how he's looking forward to a more robust, lively approach to the figures of the Madonna and child. We see here on a gold ground, which is a traditional background for an Italian picture of this date, but the child has become more animated, more lifelike than you might have seen in other pictures. The wonderful detail of this apple, of course, reminds us that the infant Christ is redeeming us. It's the apple of the original sin. So even in these small ways, Bellini's reminding us the whole purpose of Christ coming to the world and what the purpose of this picture really is. Now let me take you to another picture, this time secular in nature. We have in January a wonderful painting by Andrea del Sarto. Del Sarto is one of the great masters of the Florentine Renaissance. Unlike Leonardo, Raphael, Michelangelo, he stayed in Florence for most of his career, and many of his great works are still there today. This is a rare portrait by him. It's a fascinating informal portrait, which was very different from the portraiture that we saw 20, 30 years earlier. As with many portraits of this date, we aren't really sure who the sitter is. He certainly must be someone from the upper echelons of Florentine society, a noble, uh, a wealthy merchant, but we think he could be someone as important as a member of the Medici family. And Del Sarto would have been amongst the most important artists of the city and only accessible to the very richest and most important patrons. But now, let me hand you off to some of my colleagues who will show you some of the other masterpieces that are here at Sotheby's New York.
I'm here to share with you today a few more highlights from our upcoming sales, the first of which is this magnificent panel by Lucas Cronach the Elder, who is one of the leading artists of the German Renaissance. Throughout his career, he explored a variety of themes, from allegories to portraits, to scenes of courtly life, and to devotional scenes like the present. The Virgin's luminous skin and long flowing golden hair is set off pleasingly against a dark velvet fabric held aloft by two angels, one of whom looks directly at the audience. Further brilliance is found in the nearly translucent veil that covers her head, as well as a similar fabric at her neckline. This panel is fresh to market, having remained in the same private collection for over 35 years, and we are incredibly excited to be offering it as part of our Master's Week. The next highlight I would love to show you today is this masterpiece by Peter Van Mol, a Flemish Caravagesque artist active in the orbit of Peter Paul Rubens. In this painting, Van Mol depicts the story of Diogenes, a story about one's pursuit of truth and virtue. Diogenes was a Greek philosopher active in the fourth century BC. He is said to have wandered the streets of Athens with a lantern in hand in search of an honest man. We see Diogenes surrounded by a variety of figures of all ages, from the youth in the lower corner to the old woman with a weathered face at center and to the rosy-cheeked youth at left. Beyond them are a few figures in the shadows peering in from the background. While Rubens clearly influenced Van Mol, in this painting, Van Mol has integrated that influence into a pictorial style that is entirely his own. Like Rubens, though, Van Mol seems to have used a head study for the figure of Diogenes. For the same grisly, gray-bearded man appears in a few other works by the artist. It was once owned by Lucien Bonaparte and then the Rothschild family, in whose family it descended until 1997, when it was acquired by the present owner. Another highlight I would love to share with you today is a painting that rewards close examination. It is a work by Adrian Corta, a Dutch artist active around the turn of the 18th century. A soft, diffuse light bathes this scene of wild strawberries in a wan lee bowl. The rich, vibrant reds and stippled texture of the strawberries serve to pleasingly complement the soft, white surface of the porcelain bowl, upon which we find some wonderfully poetic illustrations of deer painted in pastel tones of blue and green. Emerging from the bowl is a single white blossom, a characteristic feature in many of Corta's works. What is most remarkable about this painting is the balance of the seemingly effortless elegance with the high attention to detail. It is the interplay of these two elements that is a quintessential feature of Corta's works and what makes his paintings so appealing to the modern eye. Paintings by Corta are very rare, as just over 60 examples are known. As such, this painting makes a wonderful opportunity for collectors. We're especially excited to show you today this highlight from our French section. A portrait by Nicolas de la Gilière, which dates from 1714. I'm especially excited about it because it is a masterpiece by the artist, something at a level that we just haven't seen at auction. Here the sitter is shown as the goddess Pomona, and it tells the story of the decisive moment where Vertumnus, shown at left, is revealed. And Cupid takes that disguise off in a clever and playful way. What I love about the painting is how Largillier hasn't depicted her in some sort of surprised state. She has a confident, beguiling gaze as she looks directly out at the viewer in a really beautiful, powerful way. It also has an incredible provenance, having recently been restituted to the heirs of Jules Strauss after it had been hanging in Dresden since 1959. This stunning portrait is one of many beautiful French 18th century paintings that we have in the auction. But we also have some incredible works of three dimensions in the sale. This majestic figure of the Virgin and Child standing on a crescent moon is an exceptional example of German Gothic wood carving from the late Gothic period. 
This is one of the finest pieces that has come to the market in recent years, and it was certainly prized in the medieval period. Produced in 1475 to 85 and attributed to Hans Kamensetzer, he was a leading sculptor who is also a star pupil of the most influential German Gothic wood sculptor, Nicholas Gerhard von Leiden. The Virgin here is elegant. She sways slightly, she turns gently toward the child, but she's holding him in her arms while he holds one hand up in benediction and the other he offers an apple to us. The carving is an intimate moment between mother and child. And while it's intimate and tender, they're not looking at each other, they're looking at us, the viewer, asking us to be a part of this moment. Here the facial features, but particularly in the Madonna, are refined, are delicate, and remind us of the incredible paintings with porcelain-like finishes of the 15th century by masters like Roger van der Weyden and Hans Memling. It is a pleasure to walk up to this sculpture and walk around the sculpture and see the volume of folds and the drama, and to see what Common Setzer was able to accomplish with one single piece of wood. I'm here to talk about something you don't normally see in an old master's paintings and sculpture sale, which is the Egyptian limestone figure of a man. This work is 4,500 years old and dates to Egypt's fifth dynasty, which makes it the oldest thing that we are selling this week and also a foundational work in the history of Western art. And that's what's really so exciting about this piece to me is that this is an early, early example of human figuration and specifically of man depicting himself in motion. And you see that because his left foot is striving forward. He's incredibly naturalistically rendered. You see the soft curvature on the torso, you see the lines on the biceps. And this is an iconography that is just so foundational to the canon of Western art and gets repeated over and over again from old masters to the 20th century artists like Alberto Giacometti, whose seminal series, The Walking Man, we know was directly inspired by Egyptian art from the Old Kingdom, which this piece belongs to. We're so excited to be including this work and all of the others that you've seen today. Thank you so much for joining us, and we hope that you tune in to join the sales.
Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and a very warm welcome from Sotheby's. My name is David Pollock, and I will be your auctioneer for what is sure to be an exciting sale here from our sales rooms in New York. We are extremely pleased to bring you today's auction, which is part of our annual Masters Week sales series and showcases an unparalleled collection of art, which for the first time spans millennia, from the fifth kingdom of ancient Egypt to the 19th century. Highlighting this morning's master paintings and sculpture sale is the defining late career masterpiece by Sandro Botticelli, The Man of Sorrows, an arresting portrayal of the resurrected Christ that encapsulates the artist's singular style and gives new insight to the artist's celebrated career. Contrasting with that is an Egyptian limestone figure of a man, an exquisite work that marks the first time an ancient sculpture has been presented in an old master sale. Dating to approximately 4,500 years ago, the figure spotlights an early moment in the development of figurative art in the West, which flourishes, of course, throughout works in today's sale. Further distinguishing today's sale is a remarkable group of paintings by female old masters, including two exceptional works by Artemisia Gentileschi, as well as paintings by Rachel Rausch, Anne Valet Coster, and Sophie Rude. We are also proud to present Nicolas de Largillier's Portrait of a Lady as Pomona, a stunning work by one of the premier artists in Paris during the Regency period, which was recently restituted to the heirs of Jules Strauss. Before we begin, please note the following. As your auctioneer, I may and will open the bidding on any lot by placing a bid on behalf of the seller. I may bid by placing responsive or consecutive bids for a lot up to the amount of the reserve. As noted in the conditions of business for buyers, everything is sold today under the authenticity guarantee and on an as-is basis. Additionally, the winning bidder will be responsible for state and local taxes where applicable, unless you are exempt from these by law. Buyer's premium and overhead premium will be added to the hammer price of the lot, and applicable sales tax will be due on the aggregate of the three figures as part of the total purchase price payable. For those who are intending to bid, please note the following. There is a guarantee or an irrevocable bid on each of the following lots. 1, 4, 6, 14, 29, 31, 37, 40, 46, 50, and 52. The following lots have been withdrawn, lots 44 and 45. And with that, let us begin today's auction with lot one. First up today, Sano Di Pietro's lovely and recently rediscovered Madonna and Child from the 15th century. We'll begin today, if I may, at $150,000, showing right there at 150,000 now, 160,000, 170,000. At 170,000, 180,000 there with George Walker. Welcome in, George. At 180,000 now, is there any more? 190,000. Thank you, Christopher Apostle. 190,000. At 190,000, yours, Chris. At 190,000. Any more now? At 190,000 with Christopher Apostle on my left at 190. At 190,000 now. Any more? And selling to Christopher's bid at 190,000. I'll say fair warning then with you, Christopher, still at 190. Unless there's any more, I'll say fair warning with you, Chris, at $190,000. Hammers up then at $190,000. Sold at $190,000 to you, Chris. Thank you. Your paddle 28. Lot two is next. We have St. Nicholas of Bari saving three nights from execution by Luca Signorelli, one of the leading artists of the Italian Renaissance in Umbria, showing here. Thank you very much. Allow me to start now, if I may, at 90,000. At 90,000 now, $95,000. 95,000, 100,000 now. At 100,000 dollars, at 100,000. At 100,000 now, and 10. 110,000 dollars. 110,000 now, any more now, at 110,000. At 110,000 dollars, you're coming in now at 110,000. 120, George, yours at 120,000 dollars. I have it selling to George Walker at 120,000 dollars. Any more now, at 120,000. At 120,000. Still with you, George, and selling at 120,000. I'll say fair warning first. Yours, George, at 120,000. All through then, at 120,000. Hammers up at 120,000. 130,000 online. Thank you. New place online. At 130,000. 140,000. Thank you, George. Yours now, 140. Ahead of you online with George at $140,000. One more online. One more click. With you, George, at $140,000, I have it. Any more now? Still with you, George, at $140,000. I'll say fair warning then. With you, George, ahead of you online, selling on the phone at $140,000. Hammers up then at $140,000. Sold at $140,000 to you, George. L0015. 
Thank you. Lot three, moving on. Our next lot is Alessandro Lori's bust portrait of Juana of Austria. Beautiful work on copper. Very stunning. Showing there. Thank you. And I can open this now with a bid $24,000. Now at $24,000. $24,000. $26,000. $26,000. $28,000. $28,000 $28,000 already, $28,000. Who would like 30? At $28,000. At $28,000. Who's coming in now? At $28,000. At $28,000. $30,000 online first. I have it online at $30,000. $32,000 in the room. Thank you. Our first in room bid at $32,000 now. Ahead of you online. I have it in the room selling at $32,000. Any more online? $35,000 online. It's online now. $35,000. One more? At $35,000. $38,000. Thank you. Ladies bid now with $38,000. I have it here, seated in New York. $40,000 back online at $40,000 now. Selling at $40,000. $42,000 would be next if you'd like it at $40,000. Still with the online bidder at $40,000. Any more now? At $40,000. I can sell it, and I will, at $40,000. Once there's any more, I'll say fair warning. Selling now to our online bidder at $40,000 all through Hammers up then at $40,000. Sold at $40,000. It's a paddle number three. Thank you very much. Thank you to our room. So lovely to see all of you here today in person. Lot four is next. A Gothic period sculpture, lot four, of the virgin and child standing on a crescent moon attributed to Hans Kamensetzer. Large work. And I can open us here now, if I may. At 480,000 now, at 480, 500,000, at 500,000 now, at 500,000, 550,000, 550,000, 600,000, Marcus Schwartz, at 600,000 with Marcus Schwartz, head of our sculpture department there, at $600,000. Your bid, Margie, at 600,000 now, selling at 600, any more now, at 600,000. At 600,000, I have it with you, Margie, on my left, hello, at $600,000 now, any more, at 600,000. At 600,000 now. Still with you, Margie, at 600. At 600,000 now. Coming in at $600,000 now. At 600,000. I can sell to you, Margie, and I will. At 600, once there's any advance here in the room, on the phones, still with you, Margie, and selling at 600,000. I'll say fair warning then. Still with you, Margie, at $600,000. Hammers up then at 600,000. Sold at 600 to you, Margie. Thank you to pedal number nine. Very good. Lot five is next. We have Ambrosius Benson's portrait of Mary Magdalene. Dating here from the late 15th century. Beautiful work. And I can open this here now at $400,000. At $400,000 for this. At $400,000 now. At $400,000. At 400,000, 420,000, 420, 450,000 with you, Eduardo. At 450 now. Eduardo Roberti's bid, 480 online. I have it online now, two places. At 480,000, online bidder. I see you online. 500,000 even. Yours, Eddie, at 500,000 now. With Eduardo, 550, swiftly online. Thank you, online. Yours at 550. Say six. At 550,000 now, still with Eduardo at 550. 600, I had it with Eduardo first. At 600,000, say 650, George. 650, I have it online, swiftly now. At 650 now, it's online. At 650, 700, back to Eduardo. At $700,000. 750 online. I have it now at 750,000 with our online bidder at 750. 800, back to you, Eduardo. At 800,000 now. 850 online, confident, at 850,000. So with our online bidder at 850,000. 900, George Walker, you're in, George. At 900, 950 online. At 950 now, so the online bidder still at 950,000. One million dollars, there's the bid. At one million dollars, yours, Eduardo, at one million. One one online. I have it at one one now, say one two, Eddie. At one one now. 1.2 million. At 1,200,000. Yours, Eddie, at 1,200,000. 1,000,003 online. Swift bidding. Thank you very much online. It's yours at 1,000,003. At 1,300,000. 1,300,000. 1, 4 now. Back to Eduardo on the telephone. At 1,400,000. 1,000,005. Still online now. At 1,500,000. At 1,500,000 now. 
online now at 1,500,000. George, one more? At 1,500,000. I have it online. Eduardo. What do we say? At $1,500,000, with our online bidder, selling, of course, at one million five. One more? At one million five hundred thousand. At one million five. You take a moment. You flew all the way from London, and we thank you for that. At one million five hundred thousand. You may offer it. I will take it. At one million five five now, with Eduardo at one million five five. When six would be next online, and it's yours. At one million six hundred thousand now. Back online at one million six. At one million six, all done. At one million six hundred thousand dollars. I offer it to the room, but I have it online. At one million six hundred thousand dollars. Is there any more now? I'll say fair warning. At one million six. Last chance now. At one million six hundred thousand. I'm selling it online, Eddie. Last chance. At one million six hundred thousand. Any more? Hammers up then at one million six. Sold at one point six million dollars. Paddle number forty-seven. Thank you all very much indeed. Which brings us to lot number six. And with this lot, I believe showing behind me, leering over me. I hope that's all right for you all. We come to the first work we are proud to offer today from the esteemed collection of J.E. Safra. This is Diogenes looking for an honest man by the Flemish painter Peter Van Mol, the artist's masterpiece. And for this lot six, allow me to open us now at $1.7 million now, at 1.7, at 1.7, 1.8 now, 1,800,000, 1,900,000, $1, $1, $2 million there with Balkia. At two million dollars now. Thank you, Bakia. Two million, two point two now. At two million two hundred thousand dollars with Eduardo at two million two. At two million two hundred thousand dollars. Two million four with you, Christopher. At two million four hundred now. At two million four, Christopher Apostle, head of our office. Thank you. Two million six. At two million six now. Eduardo. Two million six. At two million six now. Two million eight. Christopher. At two million eight. Yours, Chris. At two million eight now. But for the moment. At two million eight. Three million dollars now. At three million dollars now. I have it with Eduardo at three million. At three million. At three million. Yours, Eduardo, at three million. Three two. So sorry, I had a three two with Christopher. At three million two. At three million two hundred. Yours, Chris, at three million two hundred thousand. At three million two hundred now. So with you, Chris, at three million two hundred, three million five, three million five. I have it in the room now. New place at three million five. You like three three? Oh, I'll take that. We're friends. At three million three hundred thousand. At three million three. I have it in the room at three million three hundred now. At three million three. She asked for three three, and I accepted it. At three million three. Would you like three four, Christopher? I offer that to you. Three four, of course. At three million four now. At three million four now. Christopher Apostle, still three four, three five. There it is, in the room, in New York now, at three million five hundred thousand. I have it, Chris, ahead of you at three million five hundred. Three six. At three million six hundred thousand dollars. Three million six now. Say three seven. I have it at three million six hundred on my left. Three seven. Thank you so much. At three million seven hundred thousand now. At three million seven hundred. Three eight. Three million eight hundred thousand dollars. Christopher T. Apostle at three million eight hundred thousand. Yours, Chris, at three million eight. That's it. Three nine. I heard it. Three million nine hundred thousand. At three million nine. Say four, Chris. At three million nine now. I have it in the room. Four million. There it is. At four million dollars. Yours, Chris, at four million. At four million now. I'll take four one if you'd like it. I have it at four million on my left, selling, of course, at four million dollars. Four one. There it is. At four million one hundred thousand. At four million one. Ladies bid now. At four million one hundred thousand. Christopher. 
or two at 4,200,000. There was Chris at 4,200. At 4,200 now. One more. At 4,200. I have it. 4,3. There it is. At 4,300,000. Ladies' bids seated here in New York at 4,300. Christopher. 4,5. Four, five. I like that. 4,500,000. Back on bid at 4,500,000. At 4,500,000. Any more? At 4,500,000. That may have done it, Chris. It's yours at 4,500,000. I have it. I'm selling. On the left with Christopher Apostle and his bidder at 4,500,000. Is there any more? At 4,500,000. 4,600,000. At 4,600,000 now. At 4,600,000. I have it in the room at 4,600,000 now. Chris. We've come this far at 4,600,000. Selling now. In the room at 4,600,000. 4 4.8 million dollars. At 4,800,000 now. Christopher Apostle. At 4,800,000. Any more now? At 4,800,000. One more? At 4,9 if you'd like it? At 4,800,000. Still with you, Chris. And selling. At 4,800,000. Shake of the head, selling it to you, Chris. Hammers up now at 4,800,000 with you, Christopher, at 4.8. Sold at 4.8 million, panel number 42, thank you. And by the way, for those who are surprised, that is an auction racket for Peter Van Mall. Which brings us to lot seven. My Boso Dossi, portrait of a man in a black beretta here, showing on my right. Please note the estimate for this is $100,000 to $150,000. And for this, I'll open this here at $80,000, at $80,000 now, $85,000, at $85,000 now, at $85,000 now, $85,000, $90,000, $90,000 now, at $90,000, at $90,000 now, coming in now, $90,000, at $90,000, and five, $95,000 now, any more. At $95,000. Would you like to bid now? At $95,000. At $95,000. Any more now? At $95,000. Say fair warning. Last chance. At $95,000. Hammers up then at $95,000. Pass at $95,000. This brings us to lot eight. Crucifixion with the Virgin, St. John the Evangelist, and the female donor figure by 15th century Sienese painter Tadeo di Bartolo. Please also note this painting will be included in Gail, Sol Gail Solberg's forthcoming monograph on the artist, Tadeo di Bartolo. Showing there, thank you, hi. And I can open this here at $80,000. 80000 now, 85000 At 85000 $90,000. here. At $90,000 now, any more now, at 90000 At 90000 now, 95000 95,000, at $95,000, coming in now, at 95, at $95,000, any more now, at $95,000, I'll say fair warning, at $95,000, hammers up then, at 95,000. I'm sold at 95. Next up, here we have Madonna and Child by Lorenzo Veneziano and Workshop, this is lot nine. Please also refer to our online catalog for complete cataloging, shown here on my right. And I'll open us here, if I may, at $22,000, $22,000, 24000 now, 24000 24000 26000 $26,000, 26000 28000 28000 now, 28000 30000 online. Thank you, online. I see you. It's yours at $30,000, 32000 online, two places online, at 32000 all online. At $32,000, and I can sell at $32,000 now. At $32,000. At $32,000. To be at 35. 35. Online, thank you, online now at 35. 38 now, online. All online, $38,000. At 38,000 now. 40,000 online. Our online bidders, two of them, selling at $40,000 now. Any more? At 40,000, 42,000 now. 
at $42,000. Still online and selling, of course, at $42,000. At $42,000. Any more online? At $42,000. 45 online. At 45 now. At $45,000 now. At $45,000. Still online. At 45,000, and I can sell, and I will, at $45,000, unless there's any more. I'll say fair warning, still selling online. Last chance, hammers up then at $45,000. Sold at $45,000, thank you to paddle number 45. Lot 10 is next. And lot 10, we have one of the star lots of today's sale, the Phillips Madonna by the great Venetian painter Giovanni Bellini, on offer here from the descendants of Dr. Anton F. Phillips. Showing here on my right, the Phillips Madonna. And I'll open us here now at $2 million, at $2 million, 2.4 million, 2.4 million now, 2.4 million now already at $2 million, $400,000 now at $2 million, at $2 million, $400,000, 2 million, 6 thousand. 2.6 now, 2 million 600,000, at 2 million 6, 2 million 8 now, at 2 million 800,000, at 2 million 800,000 dollars, at 2 million 800,000 now, and coming in now, at 2 million 8, at 2 million 800,000 now, at 2 million 800,000 now, at 2 million 800,000 now, is there any more now, at 2 million 8, at 2 million 800,000 now, at 2 million 800,000 now, would you like to bid, at 2 million 8. At two million eight hundred thousand now. At two million eight now. At two million eight hundred thousand now. At two million eight now. At two million nine. At two million nine hundred thousand. At two million nine hundred thousand. At two million nine hundred thousand dollars. At two million nine hundred thousand dollars. Would you like to bid? At two million nine hundred thousand now. At two million nine hundred thousand now. At two million nine. At two million nine hundred thousand dollars, would you like to bid? At two million nine. At two million nine hundred thousand. Is there any more now? At two million nine hundred thousand dollars. Would you like to come in? At two million nine. At two million nine hundred thousand. Any more now? At two million nine hundred thousand. I'll say fair warning. At two million nine hundred thousand dollars. Any more now? At two million. 900,000, last chance now, at $2,900,000. I'll say fair warning then, at $2,900,000. Hammers up, is that a bid? At $2,900,000? Nine? At $2,900,000, which is any more. I'll say fair warning then, at $2,900,000. Hammers up, last chance, at $2,900,000. 900,000 to pass the 2 million nine. Thank you very much. Lot at 11 is next. Fra Diamante's Madonna and Child with Three Angels, also known as the Benson Madonna. Lot 11. And I can open this here at 200,000. At 200,000 now, at 200,000, 220,000. 220,000 now, 220, 240,000. 240,000 now, at 240,000 now, coming in at 240,000, at 240, 260,000, 260,000 now, at 260,000 dollars, at 260,000, and 80, 280,000, at 280,000 dollars, coming in now at 280,000, at 280,000 dollars, or any advance at 280,000, at 280,000 dollars now, at 280,000, which is any advance. I'll say fair warning, at $280,000, $300,000 in the room now, at $300,000. Ladies bid seated at $300,000. I have it here in New York at $300,000. So I need more now, at $300,000. I can sell at $300,000 in the room and selling at $300,000. Well, there's any more, I will sell at $300,000. Hammer's up now at $300,000. Sold at 300,000, the pedal's 368. For lot 12, we have Bartolomeo Viverini's Madonna and Child from the estate of Alexander Alexiades. 
This is lot 12. And I'll open this here at 50,000 now, at $50,000, at 50,000, 55,000, at $55,000, 60,000 now, at 60,000, 65,000. $65,000, at $65,000 for this, at $65,000 now, at $65,000, coming in now, $65,000, at $65,000 now, is there any advance, at $65,000, at $65,000 now, coming in, $65,000, at $65,000 now, is there any more, at $65,000, I'll say fair warning then, at $65,000, last chance on the phones, at $65,000, Hammers up at 65,000. Pass the 65. A 13. Here we have Madonna and Child, Saints Jerome and Catherine of Siena, by Giovanni Antonio Bazzi, called Sodoma. This is lot 13. Here we are. And here I will open us at $200,000 now, at $200,000. $200,000 now, $220,000, $220,000, $220,000, $240,000 I have, $240,000, $260,000, $260,000, at $260,000, yours Eduardo, at $260,000, at $260,000, I have it on the telephone with Eduardo Roberti, at $260,000, $280,000, new place in the room in New York, at $280,000, front row, I have it, at $280,000, $300,000 now, at $300,000, Eduardo, at $300,000. 320,000, at 320,000. Ahead of you, Eddie, at 320,000 dollars. I have it in the room at 320, 350, at 350,000. Yours, Eddie, at 350 now, at 350,000. 380, thank you, at 380,000. I have it here, just ahead of you, Eduardo, at 380, 400 now, 400,000. Yours, Eddie, at 400, at 400,000 dollars. 420, I will take at 420,000. On increment, that's yours at 420,000. At 420 now, 450. Eduardo, at 450,000. <clears> at 450,000. Yours, Eduardo, at 450. Any more? At 450,000. Yours, Eduardo, at $450,000. Give you just another moment. At 450. Last chance, selling to you, Eduardo, at 450,000. One more? At 450,000. Just this once. At 460,000. At 460,000. At 460,000. Yes. At 470,000, of course. At 470,000. Yours, Eduardo, at 470. At 470,000. Yours, Eduardo, thank you so much. Selling now at $470,000. Hammers up at 470. Sold at 470,000. Paddle number. L0041. Thank you very much indeed. And now, ladies and gentlemen, we arrive at lot 14, Sandro Botticelli's Man of Sorrows the definitive late period masterpiece by one of the great masters, indeed of the Italian Renaissance. A wonderful work showing there on my right. We're so proud to have this painting here, selling now. Allow me to open the bidding here, if I may, at $33 million. At $33 million now, at $33 million. At $33 million, $34 million. At $34 million now, at $34 million now. At $35 million, at $35 million. At $35 million now. $35, $36 million. At $36 million. At $36 million now. Coming in now. At $36 million. $37 million now. At $37 million now. At $37 million now. Is there any more now? At $37 million. At $37. $38 million with Alexander Bell. There it is. At $38 million now. At $38 million. I have it with you, Alex. What? Say it again. $38,200,000. $38,200,000. Liz Lopkowitz, the old master department, at $38,200,000. I have it at $38,200,000. At $38,200,000 now. Liz, yours on the phone at $38,200,000. Hi, Liz. $38,500. Christopher Apostle, new place, at $38,500,000. At $38,500,000. 
500,000 now. 38,500. $38,700,000, $38, $38, $38, $38, $38, $38, $38, $38, $38, $38, $38, $38, $38, $38, $38, $38, $38, $38, $38, $38, $38, $38, $38, $38, $38, $38, $38, $38, $38, $38, $38,
yours Liz now, and selling at 39,300,000. Hammers up, thank you both so much. There it is, the Botticelli at $39,300,000. Sold for 39.3. Thank you so much. Title number 46. Wonderful. Thank you so much. Which brings us to lot 15. A bust length self portrait by Jakob Ferdinand Vutt. Showing there next to the Botticelli. And I can open us here for lot 15 with a bid of $18,000. $18,000, every bid counts at $18,000, $19,000, $19,000, $20,000, $20,000, $22,000, $24,000, $25,000, $25,000, $25,000, $25,000, $25,000, $25,000, $25,000, $25,000, $25,000, $25,000, $25,000, $25,000, $25
at 1,150,000 now. 1,150,000, 1,000,000, 2. One million two hundred thousand dollars And 1,000,000, 2 now. 1,250,000, 1,250,000. George Gordon, yours at 1,250,000. 1,000,000, 3 now. 1,000,000, 3 now. I have it in the room now, 1 million three. And 1 million three hundred thousand dollars. There it is, in the room, in New York, selling at 1 million three hundred thousand. 1 million three fifty. All done. Thank you, sir. At 1 million three hundred and fifty thousand. Selling to you, George, at 1 million three hundred and fifty thousand dollars. Is there any advance now? At 1 million three hundred and fifty. I have it with you, with you, George. Last chance. Hammer's up then at $1,350,000. Sold to you, George, for one, three, five. L0025. L0025. Lot 17 is next. Very proud to be selling this lot. <clears throat> a remarkable Egyptian limestone figure of a man dating to the late fifth dynasty, considered the golden age of ancient Egypt, a truly timeless work of art. Very proud to be selling this picture here. And I will open us now at $2 million. At $2 million now. At $2 million. $2 million, $200,000. At $2 million, $200,000. At $2 million, $200,000. At $2 million, $400,000. $2 million, $400,000 now. At $2 million, $400,000 now. Coming in now. At $2 million, $400,000. At $2 million, $400,000 now. At $2 million, $400,000 million, $2 now. At $2 million, $600,000. At $2 million, $600,000. Coming in now. At two million six hundred thousand. At two million six hundred thousand now. At two million six hundred thousand. And eight. Two million eight hundred thousand after this. At two million eight hundred thousand dollars. At two million eight hundred thousand. At two million eight hundred thousand dollars. At two million eight now. Would you like to bid? Two million eight hundred thousand dollars. At two million eight hundred thousand. At two million eight hundred thousand dollars now. At two million eight hundred thousand now. Two million eight hundred now. At two million eight hundred thousand dollars. At two million eight now. At two million eight hundred thousand. Would you like to bid? At two million eight. At two million eight hundred thousand. At two million eight hundred thousand for this. At two million eight hundred thousand. Three million dollars there with Brooke Lampley. At, at three million dollars now with Brooke Lampley, our chairman of the Fine Arts Group. At three million dollars. Yours, Brooke at $3 million. I have it. On my right, at $3 million. Thank you, Brooke. At $3 million. At $3 million now. At $3 million. Yours, Brooke, before the moment, at $3 million. At $3 million now. Yours, Brooke, and selling at $3 million now. Is there any more? At $3 million. I have it with Brooke Lampley, on my right, on the telephone, $3 million to a new place. Ash, yours now at three million two hundred thousand dollars. Welcome, Ash, at three million two hundred thousand. Yours at three million two. Three four, I'll take at three million four hundred thousand. Yours, Brooke, at three four. At three million four. Say three six, Ash. At three million four hundred thousand. At three million four hundred thousand now. At three million four hundred thousand. It's with Brooke and her telephone bidder at three million four hundred. Ash, at three million four now. I have it with you, Brooke, and selling at three million four hundred thousand. Head of online, head of the rooms. Three million five hundred, I will take. At three million five. At three million five hundred thousand now. Three six. At three million six hundred now. Yours, Brooke, at three million six. Any more now? At three million six hundred. Yours, Brooke, at three three seven. Thank you very much. Three million seven hundred thousand. Three million eight. At three million eight now. So happy to have all our colleagues here bidding from various departments. It's yours, Brooke, at three million eight hundred thousand. At three million eight hundred thousand. It's yours, Brooke, at three million eight. Three million nine. At three million nine. Four million dollars. At four million now. Yours, Brooke, at four million. At four million now. For one. At four million one hundred thousand dollars. For two. Brooke. 
at $4,200,000. At $4,200,000. Yours, Brooke, for this extraordinary piece at $4,200,000. For three. Four million three now. Ash at four million three. Four million four. On the telephone. Two places still at four million four hundred thousand dollars. At four million four hundred. Four million five. Four million five now. Four million six. Four million six now. Back to you, Brooke, at four million six. At four million six. Four million seven. At four million seven now. Back to you, Ash, at four million seven hundred. At four million seven hundred thousand dollars. Ash can, it's yours at four million seven hundred thousand dollars. Brooke speaking, Brooke bidding at four million eight hundred thousand. Yours at four million eight. At four million eight hundred thousand dollars. Yours, Brooke, at four million, four million nine. Thank you, Ash, at four million nine. Let's say five. Yeah, five million dollars even. Yours, Brooke, at five million dollars. Ash, you want to say five two? At five million dollars. Five one. Five one. I tried. At five point one million. At five million one hundred thousand now. Five two. Five million two hundred thousand. Brooke now at five two. At five million two hundred thousand dollars. Five three. Five million three hundred thousand. Yours, Ash, at five million three hundred thousand dollars. Very good. Five million five hundred thousand. Brooke at five five. Determined for this extraordinary rare object at five million five hundred thousand dollars. Five six. Five million six hundred thousand. Back to you, Ash, at five million six. At five million six hundred thousand. Five seven. There's the bid at five million seven hundred thousand. At five million seven hundred thousand dollars. Five million eight. Five million eight now. Yours, Ash, five eight. Six million dollars even. At six million dollars. Brooke, at six million dollars. At six million. At six million dollars. Six one. At six million one hundred thousand dollars. Yours, Ash. Six two. I'll take that. At six million two hundred thousand. At six million two hundred thousand now. Brooke Lampley at six million two hundred thousand. At six million two hundred. Yours, Brooke. Any more now? Six million three. At six million three hundred thousand. At six million three hundred now. Back to Ash. At six million three hundred. Six million five hundred thousand dollars. I like that. At six million five hundred. Six six. I like that too, though. At six million six hundred. At six million six hundred thousand. Six seven. Six million seven hundred thousand. At six million seven hundred thousand. Six eight. Six million eight hundred thousand. Back to Ash. Six million nine hundred thousand dollars. Ash can. Seven million dollars. Absolutely. At seven million dollars. There it is. With Ash. At seven million now. At seven million dollars. It's yours, Ash, at $7 million now. Any more, Brooke? At $7 million. We've come this far. At $7 million now. It's yours, Ash, and selling at $7 million. Still with your bidder, Ash? At $7 million. Is there any more? At $7 million. 7-1. Seven, one. Seven, one. Thank you much. $7 million, $100,000. Yours, Brooke, at $7,100,000. Seven two. Seven million two hundred thousand. Back to Ash now at seven million two. That's seven million two hundred thousand dollars. 
Yours, Ash, at 7 million two. Hi, Brooke. At 7 million 200,000. I have it with Ash at 7 million two. 7 million five hundred thousand dollars is the bid. At 7 million five. At 7 million five now. 7 million six. At 7 million six now. Yours, Ash, at 7 million six. Seven seven. And any permutation, we'll take that. At seven million seven hundred thousand dollars. It's yours, Brooke, at seven seven. Seven eight. At seven million eight hundred thousand now. At seven million eight hundred thousand. Ash at seven eight. Eight million dollars. At eight million dollars now. Thank you, Brooke. At eight million dollars now. Ash. at $8 million. Selling to you, Brooke, at $8 million now. Is there any more? At $8 million. At $8 million now. $8 million 100. At $8 million 100,000 now. Still with Ash, at $8 million 100,000. Brooke, at $8 million 100,000 now. At $8 million 1 now. Still with you, Ash, at eight million one hundred thousand. Any more? At eight million one. Shake of the head. It's yours, Ash, for the moment. At eight million one hundred thousand dollars. I'll give Brooke one last chance to think. I'll give the room a chance to think. At eight million one hundred thousand. It's with you, Ash. Eight million two. New place at eight million two hundred thousand. At eight million two hundred thousand dollars in a new place with Alex Olsman from our antiquities department, of course. At eight million two hundred thousand dollars now. It's ahead of you, Ash, in a new place at eight million two hundred thousand dollars. Waiting in the wings was Alex at eight million two hundred thousand dollars. It's with you, Alexandra, at eight million two hundred thousand dollars. Any more from Ash? Any more from Brooke? I have it with Alex at eight million two hundred thousand dollars. Is there any more now at $8,200,000? Shake of the head from Ash, shake of the head from Brooke. At $8,200,000, $8,300,000. $8,300,000 now. At $8,400,000. $8,400,000 now. Back to Alex at $8,400,000. At $8,400,000. At $8,400,000. Who is walking away with this? Sorry, I had to. At eight million four hundred thousand dollars. At eight million four now. It's yours, Alex. At eight million four. At eight million four hundred thousand. Shake at the head. Thank you, Brooke. Thank you, Ash. Alex, it's yours now. At eight million four hundred thousand dollars. Hammers up. Last chance. At eight million four hundred thousand dollars. Sold at eight million four. Thank you. Panel number twenty-six. <laughs> Wonderful. Fast forwarding a few thousand years. Still to the early Renaissance there. We have the Madonna of Humility with Adoring Angels by Lorenzo Monaco and a workshop assistant, possibly Fra Angelico. And for this, I can begin the bidding, if I may. 280,000, at 280,000 now, at 280,000 now, at 280, 300,000, 300,000 dollars, 300,000, 320,000, at 320,000 now, at 320,000 dollars, would you like to bid now, at 320,000 dollars, at 320,000 dollars, coming in now, at 320,000, at 320,000 dollars now, is there any advance, at 320,000 dollars, at 320,000 dollars now, is there any more? At $320,000, I'll say fair warning, at $320,000, hammers up then, at $320,000. Pass at three twenty. dollars Lot 19 is next, an early work by Filipino Lippi, this penitent Mary Magdalene adoring the true cross in a rocky landscape. And there she is. And allow me to open us 
at four hundred thousand dollars. At four hundred thousand, four hundred twenty thousand now. Four hundred twenty thousand now. Four hundred twenty thousand already. At four hundred twenty thousand after this. At four hundred twenty thousand. At four hundred twenty thousand dollars. At four hundred twenty thousand dollars. At four hundred twenty, four hundred fifty thousand dollars. Yours, George. In at four hundred fifty thousand dollars. Yours first at four hundred fifty thousand. Selling to George Walker at four hundred fifty thousand. Thank you, George. At four hundred fifty thousand. At four hundred fifty thousand. It's yours, George. At four hundred fifty thousand dollars. Is there any more? At four hundred fifty thousand. At four hundred fifty thousand. Still with you, George. I can sell at four hundred fifty thousand dollars. Unless there's any advance, I sell to you, George. At four hundred fifty thousand dollars. Hammers up then at four fifty. Sold at four fifty to you, George. Thank you. Three one. Which brings us to lot twenty. We move on to Andrea Del Sarto's Portrait of a Man, an exceptional work that has never before been offered here at auction by this incredible Renaissance Florentine artist. And I'll open us here now, if I may, at one point five million dollars. At one five now. One five, one six, one million six now, one million six, one million seven. One million seven, one million eight hundred thousand dollars with Alex Bell at one million eight hundred thousand dollars. Thank you, Alex. It's yours now. One million eight hundred thousand. First in is Alex at one million eight. At one million eight hundred thousand dollars. Yours, Alex, at one million eight hundred thousand dollars. Have it on my right at one million eight with Alexander Bell at one million eight hundred thousand dollars now. Any more now at one million eight. At one million eight hundred thousand dollars. Still with you, Alex. At one million eight hundred thousand dollars. I can sell it to Alex at one million eight hundred now. At one million eight hundred thousand dollars. Any more? At one million eight hundred thousand dollars. Still with you, Alex. But for the moment, at one million eight hundred thousand. Any more now? At one million eight. At one million eight hundred thousand. Still with you, Alex. At one million eight. Hundred thousand dollars now. Is there any advance at one million eight hundred? At one million eight hundred thousand dollars now. I'll say fair warning. Unless there's any advance at one million eight hundred thousand. Still with you, Alex. Last chance. Fair warning in the room and selling at one million eight hundred thousand dollars to you, Alex. Hammers up then at one million eight. Sold at one million eight. Thank you. L O O fifty one. Very good. Which is a lot twenty one. We have a vibrant and enchanting portrayal of the Mary Magdalene by the master of the parrot. Showing here. Hello? And I open this here now at one hundred and forty thousand dollars. At one hundred and forty now. One hundred and forty, one hundred and fifty thousand dollars. One hundred and fifty thousand now. One hundred and fifty thousand dollars. One hundred and sixty thousand dollars. One hundred sixty thousand dollars now. One hundred sixty thousand and seventy. One hundred seventy thousand now. One hundred seventy thousand dollars now. So in advance at one hundred seventy thousand. At one hundred seventy thousand dollars now. At one hundred seventy thousand dollars now. So in advance at one hundred seventy thousand. At one hundred seventy thousand dollars now. Would you like to bid at one hundred seventy thousand? At one hundred seventy thousand dollars. Is there any more? At one hundred seventy thousand dollars. I'll say fair warning. At one hundred and seventy thousand dollars, last chance at one hundred and seventy thousand. Pass at one hundred and seventy. And now lot twenty-two. We have this portrait of an unknown gentleman, handsome nonetheless, painted by Franz Parbus the Elder, one of the leading Flemish portrait painters of the sixteenth century. Showing here, bearded man. Hope to have a beard like that one day. And I open us here at forty thousand dollars. At forty thousand. At forty thousand now. Forty thousand. Forty two thousand. Forty two thousand now. Forty two thousand now. At forty two thousand. At forty two thousand. Forty five thousand. At forty five thousand here. At forty five thousand dollars. Forty eight thousand. I have it just ahead of you. Just, just ahead of you, Eduardo, at forty eight thousand dollars. At forty eight, fifty thousand dollars. There's the bid at fifty thousand dollars. Now with you, Eduardo, at fifty thousand dollars. Selling to Eduardo's bidder at fifty thousand dollars. Thank you, Eduardo. Yours now. At $50,000. Is there any advance at $50,000? And I can sell 
on my right with Eduardo at $50,000. I'll say fair warning with you, Eduardo, at $50,000. Sold at 50. Panel number six. Moving on now. We have this exceptional St. Mary Magdalene reading by Correggio, which was newly rediscovered and previously only known in the form of copies. And there it is, the rediscovered original by Correggio. And I'll open us here now at $3.8 million. At $3 million, eight. At $3 million, eight now. At $3 million, eight. $3 million, nine. At $3 million, nine now. At $3 million, nine. $4 million. $4 million now. At $4 million. At $4 million now. At $4 million now. At $4 million. At $4 million. That's $4.2. $4.2 million. At $4.2 million. Four million two hundred thousand dollars. Now, is there any advance at four million two hundred thousand? At four million two hundred thousand dollars for this. At four million two hundred thousand. At four million two hundred thousand dollars. You're coming in now. At four million two. At four million two hundred thousand now. At four million two hundred thousand. At four million two hundred thousand. Four million three hundred thousand. Four million three hundred thousand. At four million three now. At four million three hundred thousand. At four million three hundred thousand now. At four million three, would you like to bid now? At four million three, at four million three hundred thousand, at four, at four million four hundred thousand, at four million four hundred thousand, at four million four hundred thousand dollars. So in advance now, at four million four hundred thousand, at four million four hundred thousand dollars. Coming in now, at four million four, at four million four hundred thousand dollars. Any more now? At four million four hundred thousand dollars. I'll say fair warning, unless there's any advance. At four million. $400,000. Hammers up now at $4,400,000. Fair warning at 4 4. I'm sold at 4 4. And now, lot 24, a uniquely Dutch domestic scene. The Lace Maker School by Koring van Brekelenkam. Apologies to my Dutch colleagues. Nevertheless, I open with some interest. Here now, I can open us at $60,000, $65,000, at $65,000, 65, $70,000, $70,000, $75,000. Here is a bid at $75,000 now. Any more now? $75,000, at $75,000, at $75,000 now. It's coming in at $75,000. I have it here first at $75,000, at $75,000. Would you like to bid at $75,000, $80,000 online, $85,000 just ahead of you online. At $85,000, I have it here in my book at $85,000. Yes, a paper book at $85,000. At eighty-five, dollars 90000 95 I have. At $95,000, ahead of you all now. At $95,000. At $95,000, ahead of you online, here with me, my absentee bidder at ninety-five. Thank you so much. $100,000, I have it in the room. One hundred ten, just ahead of you. At $110,000 now. Still here in my book at one hundred ten. Who would like one hundred twenty? One hundred twenty thousand. I had it here in the room. Just ahead of you online, it's in the room, clears my book, in the room now, 120,000. At 120, 130 online. Online now, 130. At 130, 140,000, thank you. At 140,000, seated directly in front of me at $140,000 now. 150 online, very clear, 150. With our online bidder at 150. 160, thank you so much. At $160,000. In the room now at 160. Any more online? One more indeed at 170 now. It's online at 170,000. At 170, 180,000. Back in the room at 180,000 now. At 180,000, 190,000 online. At 190,000 dollars. Strong online bidding now at 190,000 dollars. 200,000. Thank you. At 200,000, I have it here in New York at 200. At 200,000, say 220 online, if you'd like. At $200,000 now, 220, there it is, at 220,000. At 220,000, 240,000, $240,000. Back in the room here in New York at 240,000. At 240,000 now, 260,000 online. I have it online at 260. 
260,000. Online still at 260,000. 280,000. 280,000 now. Thank you. In the room at 280,000. At 280,000. In the room still and selling at 280,000. I'll say fair warning, but there it is at 300,000 now online. Online now at 300. At 300,000. 310, I will take. Sure. At 310,000. Thank you for that. I can hear you too. At 310,000. At 310. I offer 320 to online and they've taken it. At 320,000. At 320,000. 30. 330. 330. At 330,000 dollars. At 330,000. 340,000 online. At 340,000. At 340. One more? 350. 350,000. At 350,000 dollars. In the room, in New York, at 350,000. 360 online. At 360 now. Online bidding. Online versus the room. At 360. Shake of the head. I thank you. Online, it's yours now at $360,000. I'll say fair warning, selling online, hammers up at 360. Sold at 360. That's the panel number 53. Uh, 25 is an intimate interior scene by the Delft artist Jacobus Vrell. Showing here. And I open us here now at $200,000. At $200,000 now. At two hundred thousand dollars now, two hundred thousand, at two hundred thousand dollars. Would like to bet at two hundred thousand, two hundred twenty thousand, at two hundred twenty thousand now, at two hundred twenty thousand, at two hundred twenty thousand, two hundred forty thousand, at two hundred forty thousand now, at two hundred forty thousand dollars for this, two hundred forty thousand dollars. Or any advance now, at two hundred forty thousand dollars, at two hundred forty thousand dollars. Who would like two sixty, at two hundred forty thousand dollars now. Is there any advance at two hundred forty thousand dollars now? At $240,000, I'll say fair warning, at $240,000, last chance at $240,000. Hammers up then at 240. Pass at 240. Thank you much. Well, 26 is next here. Dutch school. Portrait of a young child in an elaborate fur costume holding a golf club. A rare example of a full-length portrait of this size from the Dutch Golden Age. A beautiful and enchanting work, I have to say. And I can open here with some interest. 40,000 now, 40,000, 42, 45 already. 45, 48,000 already. 48, 50, 55, and $60,000 already bid now for this. At $60,000 here, at $60,000 for this. At $60,000, 65, $70,000, 75, $80,000, 85, $90,000, 90, 95, 100 now, 110, 120, I have, 120 now, ahead of you, $130,000 in the room now, at $130,000, I have it, seated in the room at $130,000 now, at $130,000 already. And $130,000. I have it in New York, seated at $130,000. So any more now? $140,000. New place. $150,000. At $150,000. At $150,000. Any more now? At $150,000. I have it. Still in the room at $150,000. At $150,000. So any more? At $150,000. I have it in the room, seated. At one hundred fifty, one hundred sixty thousand dollars, one hundred sixty now. Front row at one hundred sixty thousand dollars with you, sir. At one hundred sixty thousand dollars now. Is there any more? At one hundred sixty, one hundred seventy thousand dollars. New place. At one hundred seventy thousand dollars. I have it in the back at one hundred seventy. Would you like one eighty? At one hundred seventy thousand dollars. I have it seated in the back at one hundred seventy thousand dollars now. Is there any more? At one hundred seventy thousand dollars. At $170,000. Gentlemen's bid seated at $170,000. Is there any more now? At $170,000. At $170,000. I can sell, I will sell, of course, at $170,000. 
I'll show any advance. I'll say fair warning, selling now in the back at $170,000. Last chance, hammers up, would you like to bid? At $170,000. Still in the back and selling at 170. Hammers up at 170. Sold for 170, paddle 642. Bit bright, but I think I can see that. Which brings us to lot 27. And I thank you all for your bids. We move on to this charming winter landscape by Hendrik Aberkamp, who's celebrated for his lively scenes of everyday Dutch activity on the ice. Beautiful example showing here now. And I'll open us here at $400,000 only. 400,000 now, at 400,000, 420,000, 420,000, 420,000 now, 420, 450,000, 450,000 now, 450,000, 450,000 after this, 450,000, 480,000. $480,000, at 480000 who would like five hundred at 480000 now, at $480,000 for this, at $480,000 now, who's coming in at $480,000, at $480,000 now, is there any more, at $480,000, $500,000 with Balkia, thank you, at $500,000, hello Balkia, yours at $500,000, on my left, selling now at $500,000 at $500,000, yours, Balkia, at $500,000, yours. And I will sell at $500,000, unless there's any advance, still with you, Balkia, and selling at 500,000. Sold for 500,000 to you, Balkia, thank you. Panel number 27, very clear. Number 28, we have Garrett Dow's Young Man Drawn by Candlelight. An enchanting small work, there it is. Showing here. Now $100,000 starts us at $100,000 now. $100,000, $110,000, $110,000, $120,000, $120,000 now. $120,000 at $120,000, $130,000, $130,000 for this. At $130,000, at $130,000, at $130,000, $140,000. $140,000, at $140,000, $150,000, thank you, in the room at $150,000. How are you? At $150,000, I have it, first in, at $150,000 now. Selling at $150,000, I have a $160,000, new place, still in the room at $160,000. Gentleman's bid, seated at $160,000, still in the room at $160,000, $170,000, all in the rooms, love to see it, at $170,000. At $170,000 now, closer to me, ladies bid at $170,000. 180,000, thank you, gentlemen's bid, at 180,000, 190,000, at 190,000, 200,000, at 200 now, gentlemen's bid at 200,000, seated back, 220, 220,000, closer to me now, at 220,000, 240, 240, 260, 260,000, ladies bid now, 260, 280,000, 300,000, closer to me now, at $300,000. At 300,000, at $320,000. At 320, farther back, at 320,000. 350,000. I have it here now, at $350,000. Closer to me, at 350,000. At 350,000. 380,000. Thank you, sir. At 380,000. 400,000. There's the bid, at $400,000. Closer to me. Ladies, bid now, at 400,000. Any more now? One more? At 400,000. 420. At $420,000. Farther back at 420,000. 450,000. At 450 now. I have it here at 450. 480. 480,000. 500,000 even. There's the bid at $500,000. Thank you. At 500,000. At $500,000 now. 550. At 550,000. But 575, I will take. At 575,000, closer to me. Would you like 600, sir? I offer it to you. At 575,000. At 575,000 dollars. Closer to me now and selling at 575,000 dollars. Would you like 600? 600, there's the bid. At 600,000 dollars, thank you so much. Shake of the head. At 600,000 dollars, selling now in the room to the gentleman seated 
at $600,000, unless there's any advance, I will sell at $600,000, fair warning, at $600,000. Sold at $600,000. To paddle, your paddle, sir, 646. Thank you so much. Thank you both. A 29. We have a beautiful pair of paintings by Nicholas Picnoy, Portraits of a Man and a Lady Holding Gloves. I believe showing outside as you entered the seventh floor here at Sotheby's. And I can open the bidding here, if I will, at $400,000, at $400,000, at $400,000 now, at $400,000, $420,000, $420,000, $440,000, $440,000 now, at $440,000. At $440,000, $460,000, there it is, $460,000. With Balkian now at $460,000, at $460,000, at $460,000. Who would like $480,000, $480,000. With you now, George, at $480,000 now. Is there any more now? $480,000. With George, at $480,000, $500,000, thank you. At $500,000, closer to me now, at five hundred. dollars at $500,000. 550, new place. I have it in the room at 550,000. At 550,000 dollars. At 550,000 dollars. Gentlemen's bid at 550 now. At 550,000. 580, I will take. At 500. Please. You need and save, please, to me, George. At 580,000. At 580,000, yours. At 580. 600? 600,000. There's the bid. At six hundred thousand dollars, seated now at six hundred. It's in the room at six hundred thousand dollars. Gentlemen seated at six hundred. Yeah, at six hundred. Six hundred twenty thousand dollars is the bid. At six hundred twenty thousand dollars, there it is with George Gordon at six hundred twenty thousand. Say fifty. Six hundred fifty thousand. Six hundred fifty thousand dollars. Gentlemen's bid still at six hundred fifty thousand dollars. 680,000. On my left, at 680,000. At 680,000. 700,000. At 700,000 dollars now. I have it in the room. Thank you. At 700,000. At 700 now. 720,000 dollars. With George now. At 720,000 dollars. Say 50. At seven hundred and twenty thousand dollars. Seven fifty, thank you. At seven hundred and fifty now. At seven hundred and fifty thousand dollars. Seven eighty. Seven hundred and eighty now. With George Gordon at seven hundred and eighty thousand dollars for these beautiful portraits. At seven hundred and eighty thousand dollars. Eight hundred. At eight hundred thousand dollars. Still in the room now. At eight hundred thousand dollars. Eight twenty? Eight twenty with George at 820,000. At 820,000. At 800, 850,000 now. $850,000. Yours, sir, $850,000. Say 80, George. At $850,000. At 850,000. 880,000 dollars. At 880,000 dollars now. I have it here on my left at 880. At 880, shake of the head. Yours, George, at $880,000. I'll sell to you, George Gordon, on the telephone at $880,000, unless there's any advance, still with you, George, and selling at $880,000. Hammers up then at 880. Sold for 880. Thank you, George. L0001. An early subscriber. Determined. I'm told by a birdie somewhere that those are also an auction record for Picnoy. Congratulations to him. Lot 30 is next. Charles Wout here. A portrait of Baron Evard de Formo as a youth. And I open us here now, if I may, at $42,000 now, at 42 only. At 42,000, 45,000, at 45,000, at 45,000 dollars, 48,000, 48,000 dollars now, at 48,000 dollars, 
at 48, 50,000, 55, just ahead of you, George. 55 now, 60,000. Yours at $60,000. At $60,000 with George C. Walker at $60,000. Yours, George, at $60,000. At $60,000 now. At $60,000. Any more? $65,000. Thank you. At $65,000. In the room at $65,000. Ahead of you, George. $70,000. At $70,000 now. On the telephone at seventy. dollars at 70, 75,000. Back in the room at $75,000. At 75,000, 80,000. George, at 80,000. 85,000, thank you. At 85,000 now. I have it at 85,000, 90,000. At 90,000, back to you, George. 95,000, 95,000. 100,000, 100,000 even. At 100,000. Thank you so much. Yours, George, at 100,000. Any more? At $100,000. Yours, George, at 100,000. 110,000. New place. With George, at $110,000. 120. 120,000 now. At 120,000. 130,000. At 130,000 dollars. At 130,000. George versus George. How many times have we been here before? At $130,000. At 130000 George Wachter now at $140,000. At dollars George George Wachter at $140,000. At $140,000. $150,000. At $150,000 now. At $150,000. George Gordon at $150,000. I'll take that as a sign. At $150,000, yours, George, and selling at $150,000. Hammers up then at 150. Sold at 150. L0025. L0025. Next is lot 31. The first of two works from the famed artist, Artemisa Gentileschi, both of which are on offer today from the collection of J.E. Safra. The first work is a stunning portrait. It is one of the few by the artist to have survived. Showing here, stunning work. And I open us here now at $1.7 million. At one seven now, one eight. At one million eight now. At one million eight, one million nine. At one million, two million dollars already with George at two million dollars. There's the bid at two million dollars now. At two million dollars. At two million dollars. George, yours at two million, two two. At two million two now with Chris at two million two hundred thousand dollars. At two million two hundred. Yours, Chris, at two million two hundred. At two million two hundred thousand dollars. It's yours, Christopher. At two million two hundred thousand dollars. Or any more now. At two million two. Yours, Chris, at two million two hundred thousand dollars. And I can sell to Christopher T. Apostle at two million two hundred thousand dollars with you, Chris, at two million two. Is there any more now? At two million two hundred thousand. At two million two hundred thousand dollars, then, and I can sell on Christopher's telephone line for two million two hundred thousand dollars. I'll say fair warning first. At two million two hundred thousand, with you, Chris. At two million two hundred thousand, hammers up at two million two. Sold for two point two million dollars. Thank you, Chris. Panel number thirty. A thirty-two. We have Car Carlos Arachani's penitent Saint Peter. Oil on copper. Showing there, thank you. And I open us here now at forty-two thousand dollars. At forty-two thousand dollars, forty-two, forty-five, forty-five thousand now. At forty-five thousand dollars, forty-five thousand, forty-eight thousand, forty-eight thousand dollars, forty-eight thousand, fifty thousand dollars, and fifty thousand dollars, and fifty thousand for this, and fifty thousand dollars, fifty-five thousand dollars, fifty-five thousand dollars for this now. At fifty-five thousand, so in advance now at fifty-five thousand. At fifty-five thousand dollars. Coming in at $55,000 at $55, now. Is there any advance at $55,000? I'll say fair warning at $55,000. Hammers up then at $55,000. Unsold at $55,000. Lot 33 is a lively portrait of a lute player by the German artist Johann Liss. Painted in Venice in the early 1620s. Wonderful moment from this career. And I open us here 
at $42,000, at 42 only, 42, 45, 45,000, 45, 48,000, 48,000, 50,000 now, 50,000, 55,000 already, $55,000, $55,000, at $55,000 for this. At $55,000, you're coming in now. $55,000, $60,000 on the way back. At $60,000, I have it. At $60,000 and selling, at $60,000. Seated in New York, thank you. At $60,000 now, is there any more? At $60,000. At $60,000, I have it. And selling. Here in New York, at $60,000. If there's any vans, I will sell for $60,000 here in New York on the telephone at $60,000. Hammers up now and selling at $60,000. Sold for $60,000 to paddle number 641. A 34 is next. We move on to Giuseppe de Ribera's Honest and Direct, like me. Depiction of St. Joseph with a plain and square. So I'm not comparing. And I can open us here now at $100,000, at $100,000, $110,000, $110,000, $110,000, $110,000, $110,000, $110,000, $110,000, $110,000, $110,000, $110,000, $110,000, $110,000, $110,000, $110,000, $110,000, $110,000, $110,000, $110,000, $110,000
Liz, because you worked so hard before, I will, say, I will take it. 290,000 at 290 now. With you, Liz. Clears my book at 290,000. At $290,000. At $290,000. With you, Liz. At $290,000. Who would like 300? At $290,000. I have with you, Liz, settling now for $290,000. If there's any advance, I will sell. No regrets. At $290,000. To you, Liz. On the phone. Hammers up at $290,000. Thousand dollars. Sold two hundred and ninety. Panel number thirty-three. Thank you very much indeed. Brings us up to lot thirty-seven. The last in this group of still lifes, we have Adrian Cortes, still life of Fros de Bois in a Wanley bowl upon a stone ledge. Stunning work showing there. And I'll start us now at 1,200,000. At 1,200,000 now. At 1,200,000 now for this. At 1,200,000, 1,300,000. At 1,300,000 now. At 1,300,000 now for this. At 1,300,000. now. And four. 1,400,000. At 1,400,000. At 1,400,000 now for this. At 1,400,000 now. At 1,400,000 now. At 1,400,000. At one million four hundred thousand, one million five hundred thousand dollars with Liz Lobkowitz again. Thank you, Liz. At one million five hundred thousand dollars, at the right, on the phone with you, Liz. At one million five hundred thousand dollars for this. At one million five on my right, and selling at one million five hundred thousand dollars. Yours, Liz. But for the moment, at one million five hundred thousand dollars. Now, any more? One million six in the back. At one million six hundred thousand now. At one million six, new place at one million six hundred thousand. Gentlemen's bid, one million six. At one million six hundred thousand now. At one million six hundred. Still gentlemen's bid. One million seven, I will take. At one million seven now. I have it with you, Liz, at one million seven. At one million seven. One million seven hundred thousand dollars for this incredibly rare painting with you, Liz. At one million seven hundred thousand dollars, with you, Liz. One million eight. I have it now. One million eight here in New York at one million eight hundred thousand. Standing now, one million eight hundred thousand. Say nine, Liz. At one million eight hundred thousand. One million eight. Any more? One nine. One nine. Absolutely. And one million nine hundred thousand. At one million nine hundred thousand, Liz Lobkowitz, yours. Hi, Liz. At one million nine hundred thousand dollars, I have it in two places right now. At one million nine hundred thousand. At one million nine. At one million nine hundred thousand dollars. Still with you, Liz. Say two, sir. At one million nine hundred thousand dollars. One nine fifty. I will take. At one million nine fifty now. At one million nine fifty. I'll offer you two million, Liz, if you'd like it. At one million nine hundred and fifty thousand dollars, standing here in New York, at one million nine fifty. Two million dollars, that's the bid. At two million dollars now. At two million dollars. Still with you, Liz, now. At two million even. At two million dollars now. At two million dollars, sir. All done? At two million dollars even? Selling to you, Liz, on the telephone at $2 million. Is there any more? Selling with you, Liz Lopkowitz, at $2 million even. I'll say fair warning then, last chance, with you, Liz, at $2 million. Hammers up at $2 million. Sold at $2 million. Thank you, Liz. Paddle number two. How symmetrical. I like that. Which brings us to lot 38. We have Jan van Huysum's Holy Family at Rest in Egypt. Wonderful landscape by this artist. And I can open this here at $100,000 now. At $100,000, $110,000, $120,000. dollars for this. $120,000 now. $120,000 now. $120,000, $130,000. Thank you, in the room now, at $130,000. I have it at $130,000 now. Is there any more? At $130,000. Selling here in the room at $130,000. Is 
So there's any advance, I'll say fair warning, selling now in the room for $130,000. Hammer's up then at 130. Sold for 130 to panel number 626. Thank you much indeed. A 39. We move on to Valerio Castello's dramatic and emotive flight into Egypt. Takes two of our wonderful handlers there. Thank you so much, guys. And I open this here now at $100,000. At 100,000, 110,000, at 110,000, 120,000, 120,000 now, 120,000, at 120,000, 130,000, 130 now, 130,000 dollars, 130,000 dollars. Any more now? At 130,000 dollars. At 130,000 dollars now. Coming in at 130,000. At 130,000 dollars now. Is there any advance at 130,000 dollars? I'll say fair warning then. At 130,000 dollars, 140,000 online. High online. Yours at 140,000 dollars at $140,000 now, and selling at $140,000 to our online bidder. I'll say fair warning, with you online at $140,000. Hammers up at 140. Sold at 140, panel number 93. And now lot 40. We have the second of our wonderful works by Artemisia Gentileschi this morning. Still this morning for a few minutes. Susanna and the Elders, which dramatizes the biblical story that can be read as a proto-feminist allegory. Not showing here as it's quite large. And I'm gonna open this here now for this wonderful work at 1,400,000 now. 1,400,000 now, 1,400,000, 1,500,000, 1,500,000 now. 1,500,000 for this, 1,500,000, 1,600,000, 1,600,000, 1,700,000. One seven now. One seven fifty with George. I will take at one million seven hundred fifty thousand dollars. Yours, George, at one million seven hundred fifty thousand dollars. At one million seven hundred fifty thousand dollars. On my right, selling at one million seven hundred fifty thousand dollars. Now, is there any more? One million seven fifty. At one million seven hundred fifty, I will take one eight at one million seven hundred fifty thousand dollars. Any more now? at $1,750,000, still with you, George, and selling at $1,750,000. Hammers up, then, at $1,750,000. Sold to you, George, for one seven five. Uh, Lots of Paddle 12. Thank you. And now lot 41, A wonderful gilt bronze sculpture depicting depicting Princess Anna Colonna Barberini by Gabriella Renzi and Francesco Contini on offer today from the Albright Knox Art Gallery in Buffalo, New York. Tough loss the other day. This is lot 41. And I can open us here at $100,000, at 100000 even, at 100000 now, at 100000 110000 110000 $110,000. $110, at $110,000, $120,000, $120,000, $120,000 now, $120,000, at $120,000 now, at $120,000, so any more, $120,000, $130,000, Margie Schwartz, thank you, Margaret, $130,000, yours, at $130,000, with Margie, on the telephone, selling now, at $130,000, Yours, Margie, at $130,000 on the phone. Thank you, Margie. Hammers up now at $130,000. Sold at $130,000. And your paddle number, 36. Thank you. We now come to lot 42, Christ driving the money changers from the temple which was rediscovered as the work of Dirk van Buren in 1996. Again, also a large work. And I open this here now, 200,000. At 200,000 now, 220,000 dollars. 220,000, 220,000 now. 220,000, 240,000. 240,000, 240,000 dollars now for this. 240,000, 240,000, 260,000. 260,000 dollars. $260,000 even. 
at $260,000 now, at $260,000, and $280,000, $280,000 now, at $280,000. Is there any more? $280,000. At $280,000. Is there any more now? At $280,000. If there's any advance, I'll say fair warning, at $280,000. Hammer's up now, at $280,000. I'm told 280. That was lot 42. This is lot 43. Please note here that the correct attribution for this lot is Milanese school, last quarter of the 17th century. And the scene portrayed is the Fiera del Perdono at Melagnano. Please refer to our online catalog for the additional provenance and literature, as well as an updated catalog entry. Wonderful bit of research here. And I can open this, lot 43 here, at $42,000 only. 42, 45 now, $45,000, $45,000, $45,000, thank you, 45,000, 48,000, 48,000 now, 48,000, 50,000, ahead of you, 55,000, I have ahead of you, $60,000, Ali, yours now, at $60,000. Thank you, Alejandro Rossetti, at $60,000 now. Hello, Ali, at $60,000, yours. And selling 65 online. I have it. $70,000 with Ale at 70 now. 75 new place. Thank you. With 75,000 now. At 75,000, it's in the room and selling at 75. Head of you online in the room at $75,000. Is there any more now with 75,000? I have it now selling in the room at $75,000. I'll say fair warning then at $75,000. Yours, sir. Looking for a paddle, perhaps, at $75,000. Hammers up at 75. Sold at 75,000. Thank you. A paddle number, perhaps? There it is, 634. Thank you. Lot 44 has been withdrawn, as has lot 45. So we move swiftly on to lot 46. A luminous canvas of St. Francis in ecstasy by El Greco with Workshop. Fabulous painting, there it is. And I open us here now at 400,000, 420, 450 now, at 450,000, 450, 500,000, at 500,000 dollars for this, 550 now, at 550,000 dollars, 800,000 dollars is the bid with Ale, thank you Ale, at 800,000 dollars, you heard it, at 800,000 dollars, with you Ale, at 800,000 dollars now, 850, New place, Christopher at eight hundred and fifty thousand dollars. Eight hundred and fifty thousand, Chris at eight hundred and fifty thousand now. Yours, Christopher at eight hundred fifty. Nine hundred online. Hello, online. Few places now at nine hundred thousand dollars. Nine fifty, Chris at nine hundred and fifty thousand. Back with you, CTA at nine fifty. How about it, online? Say a million even. At nine hundred and fifty thousand dollars now. Nine hundred and fifty thousand. I have it with you, Chris. Still. And nine hundred and fifty. And nine hundred and fifty thousand dollars. Still with you, Chris, and selling. And nine hundred and fifty thousand dollars. One more online. Make it an even million, perhaps. And nine hundred and fifty thousand dollars. Still with you, Chris. Last chance, then. I will sell. At nine hundred and fifty thousand dollars. Yours, Chris. Hammers up, then. At nine hundred and fifty thousand dollars. Sold at 950. Thank you, Christopher. Lot 45. Paddle 45. Next is lot 47. An early work, Bartolome Esteban Murillo, depicting the virgin, virgin and child. There they are. Tender picture. And I open us here now at $480,000. At 480000 now for this. At 480000 Here with me now at 480000 at 480,000 for this. 500,000 now, Christopher. 500, 550 now, ahead of you. 550,000, ahead of you. 550,000, 600,000, there it is. At $600,000 with Christopher at my left. At $600,000 with you, Chris, at 600 now. At $600,000. Yours, Christopher, at 600,000. At 600,000 now. Any more now, at 600,000. That's $600,000. It's yours, Chris, at $600,000. $650,000, Alina, thank you. Yours at $650,000. It's 
It's on my right at 650. That's 650,000 dollars. That's 650. 700,000 dollars. So we could get the board right. Thank you. 700,000 dollars with you, Christopher. At 700,000. At 700,000 now. Back to you, Chris. At 700. At 700,000. Chris. Alina, say 750. I have it with you, Christopher, at 700,000. Any more? At $700,000. Alina, shake of the hand. I understand what that means. It's yours, Christopher, at $700,000. And I can sell, and I will, at $700,000 at my left. Fair warning then, Christopher, at $700,000. Sold for 700. Congratulations, panel number 29. That was lot 47, now we have lot 48. We have this impeccably detailed royal portrait of the Marquis de Caballero by Francisco de Goya in studio. Please also refer to our online catalog for the most up-to-date exhibition history for this lot. And here, there he is. I will start at 300,000 now. 300,000, 320,000, 320,000 dollars. At 320 now, 320 for this. 320, 350,000. $350,000 now, 350000 350 now, and 80, 380000 already, 380000 at 380000 dollars at 380000 dollars now, at 400000 it's online first, at 400000 hello online, yours at $400,000, with our online bidder at 400000 at 400000 now, is there any more, at 400000 at $400,000 with our online bidder at $400,000. $420,000 in the room. I have it. At $420,000, it's in the room. At $420,000. Next in, at four twenty. dollars Head of online, head of the phones, it's in the room. At $420,000. $450,000 online. Online now, four fifty. dollars dollars eighty. Four hundred eighty thousand dollars I have it in the room at $480,000. At $480,000. In the room seated, gentleman's bid at 480,000. At 480 now, who would like 500? I have it, thank you, at $500,000, spotted, at $500,000, new place, at 500,000. In the room still, at 500,000. At 500,000 now. 550, $550,000. I have it now, 550 in the room, at $550,000. 600,000, thank you. At $600,000, 650? Yeah, 650,000, there it is. 650, 700,000, sir? 700,000, at 700 now. At $700,000, $750,000, 750 now. In the room still, at 750, 800. I have it now at 800,000, at 800,000, 850,000. 850 now, at $850,000, all in the room, head of the phones, head of online, at $850,000, at my right, at 850, 900, new place, George Walker at $900,000, 950, at 950 in the room, at 950,000, at 950, say a million, George, at 950,000. One million dollars I have ahead of you at one million dollars now. At one million even. And fifty. One million fifty now, seated still at one million fifty. I offer one one to whoever would like it. At one million fifty. One one. At one million one hundred thousand. Can I say one two? One two. Thank you. One million two hundred thousand. At one million two hundred thousand. Thank you. On the phone now. One million two. One million three. One million three hundred thousand. There it is. At one million three. Still in New York now. One million three. At one million three hundred thousand. One four. One five. I have it at one million five hundred thousand dollars. Thank you. In the room at one million five. All done? At $1,500,000. I have it in the room, selling now at $1,500,000. One six. 
One six. Thank you. One million six hundred thousand. Back to you, George. That's one million six. One million seven. And one million seven hundred thousand now. Thank you. At one million seven. At one million seven hundred thousand dollars. I have it in the room in New York. Head of online. Head of you, George. Say fifty. At one million seven hundred thousand dollars. Okay, one million seven fifty. One million eight. One million eight now. And one million eight hundred thousand. And one million eight hundred thousand now. Still in the room in New York. I have one million eight. I have one million eight hundred thousand dollars. All through George? At one million eight hundred thousand. Absolutely. Yours, sir, and selling at one million eight hundred thousand dollars. Hammers up at one million eight. Sold at one point eight million dollars. Six thirty. Thank you very much. Next we have lot forty nine, one of the most important works by Anne Valley Costa remaining in private hands. This beautiful and grand floor of still life, signed and dated to seventeen forty four, seventeen seventy four, excuse me. Showing not here, but it is beautiful. Ah, just around the corner. Thank you so much. And I will open a bidding here, if I may, at one million two hundred thousand. At one million two now. One million two. One million three now. One million three for this. At one million three. One million four already. One million four hundred thousand dollars. One million four hundred thousand dollars. One million four hundred thousand. One million five with Brad. At one million five hundred thousand dollars. On my left. At one million five hundred thousand dollars. I have it with Brad Bentoff. At one million five hundred thousand dollars now. At one million five hundred thousand, selling to you, Brad. At one million five, at one million five now. Is there any more? At one million five hundred thousand, I have it with you, Brad, and your bidder. At one million five hundred thousand dollars now. Is there any more for this extraordinary work? At one million five now, with you, Brad, and selling at one million five hundred thousand dollars. I'll say fair warning. Unless there's any advance, selling to you, Brad, at one million five hundred thousand dollars. Last chance at one million five. Sell for 1.5 to you, Brad. Thank you. Panel number 24. Now, lot 50. The last offering of works by female artists is this monumental mythological scene depicting the death of St. Curious by 19th century history painter Sophie Framion Rood. Large work showing there, absolutely. Wonderful neoclassical picture. And I open the bidding now. At 400,000, at 400,000, 420, at 420, 450 now, at 450,000, 480,000, 500,000 dollars. Thank you, George. 500,000, getting us started at 500,000 dollars. There it is. At 500,000 dollars. Yours, George, at 500,000 dollars now. Is there any advance at 500,000 dollars? At 500,000, 550, new place. At 550,000 dollars now. At 550, any more, George? Yours, sir, at $550,000. I have it in the room seated here in New York at $550,000. Is there any advance now? And selling at $550,000. I'll say fair warning then. Yours, sir, at $550,000. Sold for $550 to panel number 617. Lot 51. It's a beautiful picture, a beautiful portrait by Jean Paulin Guerin. Showing there, and I offer us to begin at twenty thousand dollars only. At twenty thousand now. At twenty thousand dollars. At twenty thousand. Twenty-two thousand. At twenty-two thousand dollars here. At twenty-two thousand dollars now. At twenty-two thousand dollars. At twenty-two thousand dollars. Who's first? At twenty-two thousand. At twenty-two thousand dollars. Twenty-four thousand dollars. Calvin, thank you, Calvin. At twenty-four thousand dollars. Yours, Calvin Harvey. At twenty-four thousand dollars, and I can sell at twenty-four thousand dollars unless there's any advance. At 24,000. At 24,000. Yours, Calvin. At 24 now. Any more? At 24,000 dollars. 26 is the next bid. I'll take that. At 26,000 dollars. 28,000. Calvin at 28. 30. Back to you, Ale. At 30,000 dollars. At 30,000 now. 32,000. Thank you, Calvin. At 32. At 32,000 dollars. Any more? $32,000, yours, Calvin, thank you so much, and selling on your phone for $32,000.
ooh, 34, Calvin, I mean, excuse me, Ale, 34. Again, flew all the way up from Miami, we thank you, I'll take it. At 34, 36, 36 is yours. At 36,000, all done? Thank you for trying. At 36,000, yours, Calvin, hammers up at 36,000. Sold at 36,000 to panel number 22. Next is lot 52, a beautiful and enchanting painting of a woman as the goddess Pomona by Nicolas de Largillière, one of the most important and sought after portraitists in Paris during the Regency period, which was recently restituted to the heirs of renowned Jewish collector Jules Strauss after being held in the stock of Kunstamlungen Dresden since 1959. Thank you, and apologies. And I open us here now, if I may, at 800,000. 800,000 now. 800,000 now for this. 800,000, 850,000. 850,000, 900,000. And 900,000 dollars. 950, with you, George Walker, at $950,000. And $950,000 for this. I have it with you, George, and selling at $950,000. At 950 now, sold with George, at $950,000. At 950 now, yours, George, and selling at 950. One million dollars, Brooke Lampley, welcome back. At one million dollars, yours, Brooke, at one million dollars. Any more, George? At one million dollars now, it's yours, Brooke, at one million, and selling at one million dollars now. Is there any more? At one million dollars now. I can sell to you, Brooke, and your telephone bidder at one million dollars even, and I will, unless there's any advance, at one million dollars. Still with you, Brooke, with our thanks, at one million dollars, hammers up at one million. Sold at $1 million at panel number 37. Lot 53 is next. A sumptuous depiction of the Greek goddess Danae by the great master of the Rococo, Francois Boucher, in his studio. Showing there. And I can open us now with some interest at 100,000, at 100,000, 110,000, 110,000, 120,000 here in my book at 120,000 and selling at $120,000. Here at $120,000, I have it registered and I have it selling at $120,000 now. So there's any advance at $120,000, I'll say fair warning, selling here at $120,000. Sold at 120, panel number 18. Lot 54 is next. This dramatic view of the Mediterranean coast, painted by Claude Joseph Vernet in 1747. And I can open this here now at $200,000 for this. At $200,000 now. At $200,000. At $200,000 for this now. At $200,000. $220,000. $220,000 now. $220,000 now. Any more now? $220,000. And forty. dollars $240,000. At $200,000. Excuse me. $240,000 now. At $240,000. Is there any events at $240,000? Try to come in at $240,000. At $240,000 now. Is there any events at $240,000? I'll say fair warning now. At $240,000. Hammers up then at two forty. dollars Pass the 240. 55 is next. A sensual and delicately colored painting but of Jupiter and Callisto by the Venetian Rococo artist Jacopo Amagoni. Quite sensual, Benjamin. I think it is, in fact. Now, I open us here at $65,000. At $65,000 now. At $65,000. $70,000. At $70,000 now. At $70,000 now. At $70,000. $75,000. At $75,000. At $75,000 here. At $75,000 now. Is there any advance at $75,000? At $75,000 now. Is there any advance now? At $75,000, I'll say fair warning, at $75,000, hammers up then at 75. I'm sold at 75. And the penultimate lot today, this morning at least, it's lot 56, a picturesque view of Venice's Grand Canal the Rialto Bridge by Michele Marieschi. Beautiful picture from a private collection. And I open this here now at 300,000 now. At 300,000 for this. At 300,000. At 300,000. 320,000. 320,000. At 320,000 now. Coming in now. 320,000. 
320,000, 350,000, 350,000 here. At 350,000 now for this. At 350,000 here. At 350,000 dollars. Or in advance now, at 350 and 80. 380,000, 400,000 dollars. I have it in the room at 400,000. Thank you. At 400,000 dollars. In the room now, seated at 400,000 dollars and selling at 400,000 dollars. Or in advance at 400. At $400,000 now. I can sell, and I will, at $400,000 all through then, selling here in New York at $400,000. Hammers up at $400. Sold at $400. Thank you very much. And your paddle is $610. Which brings us to the last lot from this morning's session. Is by Gaetano Gandolfi, a beautiful sketch of a bearded man in profile. Fabulous condition, fabulous work. And I open us here now at $240,000 now. At 240,000, at 240,000, 260,000. At 260,000 for this. 260, 280,000 already. At 280,000. At 280,000 dollars. At 280,000 dollars now. So in advance, at 280,000. At 280,000 dollars. Who's coming in first? At 200, $300,000 even with you, George. Thank you. At $300,000. I have it selling with George's telephone bidder at $300,000. So any advance now at $300,000. At $300,000 now. It's yours, George, at $300,000. So any more. At $320,000 with Emily Seltzer next in at $320,000. Thank you, Emily. Yours at $320,000. $350,000 back to George at $350,000. At $350,000 now. Yours, George. I will take 370 from you, Emily. Thank you so much. At $370,000. At 370,000. Yeah, 400,000. Yours, George, at 400. Say 420, Emily. At $400,000. Yours, George, at 400. Yeah? At $400,000. Yours, George, at 400. 420. Thank you. At 420,000. Back to you, Emily, at 420. 450 with George now at $450,000. All on my right, two phones at $450,000. I'll take $470,000 at $470,000. Yours, Emily, at $470,000. Say five, George, if you'd like it. At $470,000. Yours, Emily, $500,000. There's the bid at $500,000 now. Yours, George, at $500,000. At $500,000. Sorry? 550. There it is. We like that. Thank you, Emily. At $550,000. 580. 580. George, at 580 now. Mm. I did take 580. You're right. 590. We're almost there. At 590. At 590. Yeah, 600,000. Thank you. At 600,000 then. All done? At 600,000. Yeah, 620. I thought you might. At $620,000. Thank you, Emily. At 620. George. At 620 now. It's with Emily Selter on the telephone at 620,000. 630,000. We work hard for our clients. At 630,000. Yeah, 640. At 640,000. 650. At six hundred and fifty thousand dollars, Emily, say six seventy. At six hundred and fifty thousand dollars. At six, six seventy. Six sixty was it? Okay, six hundred sixty thousand. At six hundred and sixty thousand. At six hundred and sixty thousand. Any more, George? At six hundred and sixty thousand dollars. At $660,000, I can sell to Emily Selter on the telephone at $660,000. I'll say fair warning then, with you, Emily, and selling at $660,000. All done, George? At $660,000. Hammers up then at six sixty. dollars Sold for six hundred and sixty dollars to you, Emily. Paddle one, two, three. Thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, that concludes our master paintings and sculpture auction. Thank you all for your participation. Please stay tuned for our sale of paintings, drawings, and sculpture from the collection of American realist painter and famed portraitist Nelson Shanks, taken by my colleague Simon Shaw, which will begin at 2 p.m. Eastern. With that, I wish you all good morning, good afternoon, and good evening wherever you are in the world. 
Thank you all. Take care.